I came upon a shattered glass jar and four baby turtles. That was us. Hmm? We're crawling into a strange glowing ooze from a broken canister nearby. Pizza! Pizza! More oh. words followed, and I began their training, teaching them all that I had learned from my master. What's up guys, Sahaman back with another review. Today we're going to be taking a look. I have not reviewed a lot of NECA stuff. It's been a while since I've done some NECA stuff. I'm kind of cutting back on a lot of NECA's collectibles, but I had to pick up the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Baby Turtle Accessory Set. I also picked up, and this has been out for a minute, the Mutagen Canister Prop Replica from uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. So I'm going to review both of these. So first off, let's look at the packaging for the uh, Mutagen Canister. So you got it right here. You can see the canister right there. It looks really nice. Love the packaging on this. You got some images right there on the side. It says TCRI. And then you come over here, some more close-ups in the packaging. And then right there is reads Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and you have the city on the top right here on the back so it does it says here both end caps twist off reveal hidden features ooze jar in what this is ooze jar stores in twist off cap twist off to access battery compartment so it does come with the ooze which is really really cool but i love the packaging on this so there's that and then we have the big part for the review right here we have the uh, turtle baby except turtle Baby turtle accessory set. So you have the big open window right here. You have the pizza box in the back. Looks like it comes with some chips, some pizzas. You have all four turtles right over here. Um, on the side, you got some images on how you can display the turtles, you know, different poses and whatnot. And then it does come with a nunchuck for Raphael. I'm uh, sorry, for Michelangelo, which is pretty awesome. So this is some of the accessories that, you know, pretty much everything that you're going to get in the packaging here. So what we're going to do is open both of these up. It's going to be a long review, but hey, grab a drink. And let's get started. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Heroes in a half shell. Turtle power. They're the world's most fearsome fighting team. Teenage Mutant Marine. Ninja Turtles. They're heroes in a half shell and they're green. Hey, get a grip. When the evil shredder attacks, these turtle boys do right, guys, so here we have the Mutagen Canister. So you can see right over here, it does read CG2 radioactive material, and it's got the crack right there in the canister. It does read TCRI right over here, and both of the ends actually screw off, so you can see that right there. Um, here's the slime, so you got the TCR radioactive material, and you can see the uh, cool little label on there, and then it, it's actual slime, so it says reusable reusable slime. I probably should have taken the tape off before I'd done that, but I'm not going to actually be putting the slime in there because I don't want to make a mess. But just so you guys know, this does take, or it does come with a slime. Uh, when you unscrew the end piece on here, this is the, this on this side is where the slime was. At. And then on this end right over here, you have the on and off switch and it takes three AAA batteries. So you put that on, turn that switch there and you can see the really cool light up effect. Now you're probably not gonna see a lot of it because I have the lights on, but let me dim the lights down. I only got the top light going on, but um, it's still not, the camera's not picking up the light that great, but it's really, really bright LED light. Really cool. Let me, you know what? Let me get it dark in here. All right, so hopefully that's a little bit better right there. So that's really awesome. And again, you can put the slime in here, but I am not gonna be doing it on the review, maybe towards the end of the video, but here's a quick look at the canister. Now let's bring out the baby turtles. Take out the baby turtles. We gotta look at all the accessories that come with the set. So you get a total of four pizzas, which is awesome. I mean, if you guys have the quarter scale turtles, they're gonna come with pizzas anyways, but you do get the pizzas right over here. So if you guys have any of the pizzas from the quarter scale turtles, it's pretty much the same thing, nothing different. Um, so you get that. Another cool touch, which I think is awesome, is you get the pizza box from Domino's. It's better delivery, and you can see right there it says title game pizza. Take the title game survey, eat pizza every day, deliver your takeout, add some tasty but never wasty tile game garlic knots to your next order. Get an extra large three topping pizza for $13. Bonus crust, how cool is that? 
So that's like the little uh, coupon, I guess you can say, right there. So it is a separate piece of paper. Um, it doesn't say Domino's on here though, but obviously it is Domino's. It says delivered in 30 minutes, maybe less, and it says life, eat, smell. So that, <laughs> that's so awesome. Free delivery uh, right over here. Drivers carry less than $20. Free delivery all right there. And then you have the opening of the box, and you can see kind of like the grease residue on here, which is super dope. It says, if you did not order penicillin on your pizza, please discard right away. And then you got some more over here. Name M. Angelo delivered to 122, 18th, and 23rd Street, New York. Total $13. That's awesome. Has a driver name too. So it's got a lot of cool little, little detailing on here. And then, of course, you can just put the uh, the pizza in here and you have a full blown, not full blown, but you got four slices of pizza in here. So how dope is that? So you have that there. You also have the chips uh, that Michelangelo was eating. You got the corn snack right over here, true, true crunch and more. And then it also reads average size snacks, chips, snacking corn. Really nice. And it, it looks like there's like a, a soft, maybe styrofoam in here. Uh, try some snacking corn go for chips quality folded golded juice boxes pork rinds frozen pizza Shepherd's pie, so that's pretty awesome that you get this right here And then you also get some stickers over here. You got some band-aids to place on a, on the turtles face uh, Raphael, I don't know what these two are. I don't know what these two are supposed to be You guys can let me know in the comments below But these two top ones are band-aids if you want to put them onto the turtles we get Michelangelo's hand right here so if you have the ones for scale Michelangelo, you have the uh, nunchucks. You can see you get this really cool nunchuck right there. Another another accessory. It's not focusing in on there. So you got that, and you have this little peg right here, which pegs on right there. So it's like that the battle scene when they're fighting the foot soldiers when Casey Jones steps in, and uh, you can actually spin it. So how cool is that? So you place this on your one four scale Michelangelo, and you can get this to spin. That is awesome. That's a nice touch. I really like how they included this accessory. And it actually really does look like he's uh, he has the rope right there on the tip of his finger. So that <laughs> that's so cool. You also get the really cool insert which reveals a sewer. You got a little tunnel right over here and you have a ladder and you can kind of see the water right there in the background. So this is really nice for, you know, if you guys want to take pictures of the turtles right inside there. And now we have all four turtles outside of the packaging and they're all the same. There's no real difference in any of the turtles. Maybe some of the spots might be a little different. So we're probably only going to take a look at one of them. So here is a turtle close up. You got the eyelids there. They look screen accurate for the, for the 1990 movie. Um, they do have articulation. The mouth does open and close. You can see that right there. And you can see you can make up part of the tongue. Close it up right here. You got the head sculpt, the skin texturing, and the paint applications on this look great. It lo almost looks like the eyelids would open and close. And then you have all the little spots right here on the arms. So you can see the really cool detail that they put. There's a front part of the shell. Look at all the detailing right there on the neck. It looks pretty sick. And you have the, uh, the shell right here on the back. Really nice sculpted. And then you have the lower part of the legs. He does have peg holes at the bottom of the feet. And you got his three little fingers, you got the fingernails there, and then look at the little spots on the legs, and then you have his toes, the two toes right here. Now, these guys are really limited in articulation. The only articulation, again, is the mouth. The head does rotate, uh, kind of goes up and down. You can see that there, you can tilt it too. The arms, you know, they got a swivel here, and they also go in and out. So there's no rotation like at the wrist, no bend at the elbow. The legs don't have any ro any rotation at all, so they're pre-posed, no foot articulation, so you pretty much can only move his arms and the, the head sculpt. But again, it's up to you if you guys want to put the band-aid on one of the turtles to make it, you know, screen accurate too. But it doesn't look like any of the turtles really have a big difference on these. They all seem to be, you know, pretty much, pretty much the same as the top of them right there. But really cool set. But yeah, yeah, it does look like, you know, taking a closer look at them. I mean, maybe a little bit of the spots are a little off or a little different or a little darker than others. But the hands and everything else seem to be exactly the same. And there you have it, guys. There is my review. Today we were taking a look at the NECA Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutagen Canister Prop Replica along with the Baby Turtle Accessory Set. 
I highly recommend you guys pick this up because, I mean, not only does it come with a lot of cool accessories, but you get an iconic scene from, you know, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. You get the canister and you get the baby turtles with all their accessories. The slime, did, the effect didn't work how as good as I wanted it to. I was hoping it would, like, pour all over the place, but it, it kind of does, and I guess you can mess with it. But the canister itself is cool. Now, again, both of these are sold separately. I did these, I did pick these up from the NECA lady at Best and Collectibles at Frank and Sons, so if you guys want to let her know Seha Man sent you, feel free to do that, or you can pick these up at BigBadToyStore.com. Click on the link in the description below, guys. Again, it'll help out the channel for when I do a future giveaway on a really, really cool prize. But you guys let me know in the comments below, is this a pass? Is it a pickup? Thumbs up the video. Subscribe if you guys haven't. We'll see you soon. Peace.